Something a little bit different for this week's lesson. A few weeks ago, I was lucky enough to receive a voucher for a one-hour flying lesson. Only problem? It's with a different instructor in a different plane from a different airport. So today, I'm flying out of Goulburn in a Skyfox Gazelle. This flight is part joy flight, part lesson, and I'm really excited about flying out of a new airport and seeing how the Gazelle handles compared to the Chabaroo. Let's go flying. Ah, yep. Different control, <laughs> steering too, so. Oh, you have that yoke. Yeah, I've that's got the yoke in the right, so I'll be flying left handed. That's going to be a challenge too. See, you're flying right hand side. No, no, left hand side, but it's got a yoke in the middle of the. Ah. That in? Okay, that's it, it's behind you. Okay. All right. Quite, uh, quite cozy here, isn't oh, it? Yeah, you'll see when you go up in the air how bloody freezing it becomes. Here. Yeah, right. Yeah. Don't go up too high today, then. <laughs> Some shit up here, up there in the cold weather. It's not so good, but yeah, it will. Oh, we could always fly down to Wollongong. You can. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's, it's I, a scenic flight. <laughs> in the Jabiru, you've normally got a handbrake. Is this? Oh, the, you got toe brakes as well. Yeah. Yep. And then, so how do you normally place your feet when you're not when you're flying like that? Well, see, you need brakes when you're on the ground. Of course, yeah. Right, because it doesn't steer. It doesn't have the nose wheel attached. It's the caster wheel. Oh, right. right. Okay. So you need to push your rudder yeah and also simultaneously break if you want to turn it ah okay right. and jabru what jabru is just this one yeah that's right just breaking breaking and then yeah. it turns <coughs> but in this one it doesn't okay so same control you have a joystick in jabru ah uh, yep yep so on the right though yep. um, yeah yeah I, I, I forgotten how it is yeah you got a yoke it's, on the right yes, and then you've got thing. you've got the throttle you on your left here and yeah. From my side, it was right, and uh, yeah, but yeah, same kind of a thing. You know, it's just throttle here, yeah. and you have your own stick so that you know, instructor and you both okay. are not juggling. Right. Yeah. Trim is here. Okay. This one. So yeah. in Jabru, you know, it's just uh, okay. it's in the center and probably yeah. next to your seat. I think so. Yep. Yeah. And so it's uh, not a handbrake. No, 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 no. Okay. So where's so that's for takeoff, is it? Uh, yeah. Okay. Wow, it's so I can I can barely reach the. No, thing it's going to be like that. All oh, right. When you're flying, it's going to be like that. You know, it's not going to go. It's just forward. Oh, that's as far as it's yeah, forward. It's yeah, going to yeah. go. So it's going to be centralized like that. Okay. All right. Yeah. And uh, same as like that, airspeed, artificial horizon. Yeah. Which is just not you know you never ever rely on these things. Yeah. You know, when you're flying, this one. So our elevation today is. Two thousand one hundred forty here. Yeah. At <coughs> And uh, turn belts in together. DG, yep. we normally fly with compass, we don't really fly with DG. Yeah, because you know it's not a good idea to fly with DG unless and yep. until it is a certified yep. equipment. Okay, right, radio, same, and uh, uh, the same CTF call, you know, yeah, golden traffic, data, yep. all those other things. Yeah, so yeah, any questions? 
Um, oh yeah, I guess uh, to, just coming to the feet again. So on the ground, obviously we want to have the feet up here. When I'm yep. landing, do you want to have your feet off the brakes and down here, or you're still having your feet up here but just not not touching the brakes? Still have that, but not touching the yeah. unless and until you don't do like that. Not much will happen. See, unless and until yeah. you don't push like that. Yeah. From your toes. Yeah. It will not. Okay. It's only going to be rudder. Right. Okay. Gotcha. All right. <clears throat> All right. Let's rock and roll. You want to do a checklist for me? Uh, yep. Okay, daily and pre-fire inspection is complete. Fuel valve and quantity. Uh, where's the fuel valve on this one? Yep, it's on. Fuel valve is on. Quantity? It's 17 litres here and uh, 15 litres over there. Okay. Can you see that? Uh, I can see the numbers here, but yeah. is there like a needle? No, or is that... See? see that liquid? All oh, right. Oh, you can see it. Yeah. That's different. Yeah. Um, Jabber also, you can see that the tube. Ah, uh, not on my Jabberoo. No, no. no we have a um, just like a little indicator, and then we have a uh, a digital gauge ah, there. Ah, right, right, right. Um, master switch and alternator are on. So, master switch, where are we? So that's on, is it? That on. Turn it on. Yep. Alternator. Okay, we got the alternator on? Yeah, this is the one. Maybe. Oh, that one there? Yep. Okay. Um, fuses, check. Fuses all in. Okay, they would pop out otherwise? No, they don't pop out. The thing is that, you know, they can break. Oh, okay, right. And something will come in the water. So warning. you just have to take it out and, yeah, and see if it's broken. It that's it, you know. Okay, throttle. We just want open three mils. Yep. So about there? Yep. Fuel pump on, on then off. Oh, it's working. Yep. Just like the Jabiru, brakes. Yep. So we just leave that on while we start yep. it up. Yep. Okay. Choke open if cold. So oh, it's pretty it's cold. Right. No problem. No, don't need it. Prop clear. Prop. Clear prop. All right. Starter. Ready to go. Yep. RPM set 2000. Oh, there's the RPM gauge, got it. Oil pressure rising 30 seconds. Uh, so it's uh, in the green. Yep. Fault meter between 12 and 14, which it is. Avionics are on. Turn it on. Oh, that's better. Uh, is this volume? Yep. Whereabouts you normally set it? That's it. Got it. Right, one, two, three, four, five, you read? Yep, how are you reading me? We're reading you five. Okay, good. Okay, everything's uh, uh, on AWS 136.3A, so that one, and uh, give it one click, yep, go. Taxiing uh, runway 22, Goulburn. 
Okay, so I'm going to get used to Thank these. You. Okay. It takes a little while. <laughs> oh, it's heading over. Alright. Test the brakes, okay. Yep. Get on the yellow line. Good. No. I'll be back. into the wind Okay, that's the run of base over there So okay. keep going straight Certainly a little different to the Jabber already Oh yeah Turn it up. That's it. Okay. All right. Do your checks now. All right. Brake on. Yep. Brake's on. You good with the headset? Just adjust that. Yep. All right. Taxi controls. Engine runs. Temperature inside the green. Yeah. Uh, so it's still a bit late. Up, that's all right. Throttle 3800. Yep, go ahead. No, 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 keep going. Hang up. Take over. It kind of goes up and then down. Yeah. There you go. Alright, 3800. Carby on. Bit of a drop. Back on. Alright, yeah, yep, you can hear the change in uh, CDIs. Yes. Right drop, good. Back up. Right one. Right drop. Back up. These bees are uh, in the green. Hopefully the temperature's coming up. Vols are okay. Throttle uh, check right on. Uh, it's yep. uh, low and stable. Yep, that's all right. What do you want to just stab it? That's it, yep. Okay. We take off, controls, full and free. So, we just hold it back during the takeoff run, do we, typically? Yeah, we just yeah. neutralize it. That you will feel it. You will feel it. Oh, okay, right. Yep. So, controls, check your controls. Alright, and correct sense, I presume. We're about to we... Trials full free and correct say yoke left, left aileron up, right one down, right one up, left one down, right up, right it down, okay. Instruments, check and set, so air speed is okay. Uh, the altimeter is good, turn code uh, looks pretty good, not worrying about the, uh, the DG, uh, vehicle speed, sorry, that's all right. Um, and the attitude indicator we're not worrying about, don't worry about that. Um, all circuit breakers look okay. Uh, cabin heat, carb heat, cabin heat all in. Uh, trim set for takeoff, so that's already set. Yep. Switches check on. Fuel pump on, landing light on. Fuel pump on, landing light on. Yep. Okay. Users check. Yep. Radio 127.15. And if engine fails during takeoff, we glide at 55 knots and land the aircraft no more than 30 degrees off the runway center line. Okay, line up, lights on, fuel pump on, transponder on, DI. Okay. So we're good to go? Yep. Oh, wait. Nicole? Nicole? Uh, 
hang on. Well, Say Goldman traffic first and then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And what are we doing? Are we taxing? Take five three, taxing uh, and entering on way two two for the cleaning area, traffic Goldman. Okay. Goldman traffic, Gazelle 8253 is taxing and lining up. Runway 22 for the training area, Goulburn. Start turning right, otherwise it's going to take a lot. There you go. RPM a little bit less. That's it.
as we head towards the left a little bit left hand turn climbing turn left hand but remember whenever you start turning you always check for the traffic yes yes because this is a highway gear car you can't see traffic sitting on your on your shoulder so always because your jabber is also highway yeah, gear car yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's fine. What's this big uh, coach up 
Pico. Sorry? What's his big gorge up here called? Oh, mate. Uh, good question. But uh, as I can only know that this is only a gorge, which is called, uh, which is famous for Southern Portland Quarry, which is next to the gorge. Uh, I actually don't know the name of the gorge, but it's like it. the Shellhaven. Sorry, is it the Shellhaven or Kangaroo Valley? I'll see where it is. Hang on.
Okay, we head straight towards the query. It flies quite nicely, right on the controls. Yep. Enjoying it, the different aircraft? Yeah, the interesting to see what it's like uh, coming coming into land. Yeah, that's why I guess you got to really work the speed a little bit. And yep. You will be amazed that how different these aircraft are to each other. Uh, this is beautiful. This is fantastic. So where's home from here? Back over. Yep, that's the town. So I wonder if that's uh, Jarvis Bay out there to the uh, up there to the right, yeah, out to the east there. Yeah, all right. Yeah, you can see, is that the ocean there? Um, Just see? A little bit. Yeah, I mean, if it's, yeah, if it's not a big lake, <laughs> then it's the ocean. Probably 40, 50 nautical miles ahead. On to your right. Oh, you know, it's, it's very hard to tell from this far distance. Alright, returning to the left, now following over there to Hume Highway. Okay. As from here, easy, you can see Goldman. So straight through there? Yep. Okay. So how far is that away now? Uh, roughly, we'll say 10, 10, 12 nautical miles. So I haven't spent too much time away from the uh, circuit area, so it's gauging those distances is something I'm not very good at. Is that uh, Maroon? That is... what township is that? Can't see on the map. Something here, I don't know what it is, but yeah, definitely it should be a township over here. It's another one called Talon. Okay. Uh, Ooh, it should not be far, I think, so this should be the one if the query is just on the back. Yeah, but there is a student over there who is doing 
circuits, I don't know whether he's solo. So we'll see how many circuits he's doing by the time we reach there if it's not. Yeah, that guy, yeah, that guy is doing circuits. He's solo. Helicopter box dot pocket alpha uh, currently overhead runway golf traffic and joining uh, uh, circuits for downwind for runway two. Uh, he is inbound. Uh, we don't know whether he is doing circuits or not because he hasn't uh, broadcast the intentions. He's just joining okay, right. downwind, so I don't know whether he's doing... I think so, it should be full stop, not circuits. Oh, right. 
Yeah. 
Yeah, a little bit. That'll do. That'll do. That'll do. You can't see that fat sheep. Hey? You can't see that oh, fat sheep. The big merino. Yeah. Oh, I've seen that plenty times, don't worry. Yeah, but oh, I missed it today. Oh, is it down there somewhere? Yeah. Oh, I want my money back then. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. That's why I came up before. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Uh, 
Yeah, see, did you notice that it doesn't sink all of a sudden? It keeps on, keeps on going? Compared to the Jabiru? Yeah? Yeah. Because you got to really, when you reduce the power, yeah. it's going to be really ready for it? Yeah, yeah, we will attack like that. But it's this one. Uh, while you were flying like a Jabiru, like, you know, a bit of a flatter approach with a power on, yes, I can understand from your point of view, but you can have a bit of a sweeper angle and, you know, uh, then you have a bit of a more height to lose. Yeah, because this runway is very long, so that's all good. Yeah. Right. Yep, left hand. So the traffic that I see is 6 minus 3 turning front 5 on. That is still true for the second day. 15 degrees angle of back, not more than that. That's better. Okay, level it off. Let's turn the other Yeah, yeah. Power back. More power off. 54. Beautiful. Uh, profile's coming. 
afternoon. We want yeah, to pull. Yes, yes, a little bit of power. That's better. Push the nose down. That's it. Keep pushing the nose down. Hold it over here. A little bit more power. Come on. That's better. Keep the nose going down. That's it. All right, power back. Power back. Back to idle. Back to idle. Keep going. Keep going. That's it. Hold it here. Hold it here. Hold it here. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Not too ballooning. Almost up here, zone 3, 6, 9, I believe. Stay down with the runway 2, 2, but up to go, zone 3, Alright, taking over. Okay, you have the controls. Uh, so that's what you do if someone's uh, in the circuit. Backtrack on the glass run, what are Try to go when you zero eight two five three clear for runway two two zero four. Backtrack two six. Go. Experience. Yeah, it was good. Yeah, it's just certainly different. It is. Um, but I mean, you know, uh, they all kind of fly the same. It's just getting uh, a little bit different to. Double uh, traffic is on three six nine three take final. One way two two four something guys. Double traffic. Probably just getting used to, in terms of flying, getting used to the attitudes, the, the feel of the the uh, rudder pedals and the and the yoke, and getting used to that. Yeah. And of course, every instructor has their own kind of different technique. Yeah. Um, my instructor likes to be quite close on downwind, uh, but that's that's just each uh, individual's... Um, I can understand from general point of view why they want you to close on the final end, probably, no, sorry, on the downwind. Yeah. I mean, you know, something goes wrong, you can straighten, come and land. Yeah, that's right, yeah. Um, but, frankly speaking, uh, the spacing should be all right. Uh, if the spacing is not good between your runway and downwind, then probably you have very less time on your base leg. Yeah, yeah. And if you have less time on your base leg, then probably things go very fast. Yeah. And from the student point of view, uh, when things go fast, they sometimes can't cope up with those things. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. in that sort of uh, circumstances, you know, it yeah, becomes yeah. very overloaded to a yeah. student. So you should have a bit of a time to think and, you know, to be ahead of the aircraft rather than rushing the things, doing the things correctly. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, that's so right. Yes. Yeah. Everyone has their different uh, way of teaching, yeah. as you said before. No, but it's really good. It's just good to um, fly out from a different airport, and, and um, yeah, that's always valuable experience. I mean, I've only ever flown out of Wollongong, so to come here, different attitude, you know, different taxiway, you know, yeah. taxi layouts and runways and get, getting used to all that is... Uh, Really valuable experience, so yeah, I really appreciate uh, you taking me up today. And, uh, yeah. Uh, Trusting me to uh, fly the plane? Oh, well. <laughs> Hopefully I didn't make you uh, hard fly it too much? No, 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 you're right. <laughs> And really nice to see the uh, sights of Goulburn too. Oh yes.